segment is sponsored by Texas Gas Service. It's important for all of us to practice safe digging techniques to protect ourselves and the underground infrastructure that keeps our neighborhoods, businesses, and homes up and running. Texas Gas Service wants you to help protect our lines by being a dig hero. I'm gonna flex a little bit when I say it. Safina Walji is here to tell us about Safe Digging Month, featuring dig heroes and a chance to win a hundred bucks. Safina, good to see you. Great to see you too, Rosie. Thanks for having me. Thanks so much for taking the time this morning. It scares me, I'll be honest <laughs> with you. And I think a healthy level of respect for what's going on underneath the ground is appropriate here, but we wanna educate people instead of scaring them. So 100%. let's first talk about the problem that hit lines are. How big is it? 49% of homeowners will put themselves and their communities in danger by not calling 811 before digging under the ground. What are examples of some of the things that might be running under our homes or under our businesses that we might accidentally hit? You could hit a natural gas line, for example, which could cause a leak, or even if it doesn't cause a leak, it could cause a small dent in the pipe which could eventually lead to the pipe breaking over time. So it's really important to call 811, which would send somebody from Texas 811 to mark all of the underground facilities in the area so you know where you can safely dig and keep yourselves, your families, your pets, everyone safe. Everybody's safe and everybody happy. And my understanding is all the flags get a different color depending on what kind of pipe we're talking about. So it's a real education to find out what's going on underneath yeah, your property. Yeah. <laughs> um, the natural gas flags uh, will be marked as yellow, uh, but there's lots of other ones on our website, beadigherotexas.com. You can kind of see what all the different colors are and what they mean. Well, I'm glad you brought up being a dig hero because I've never heard of one <laughs> before today. So let's talk about it. You guys have branded it. What are dig heroes? Yes, so every April we do a Safe Digging Month campaign. This year we're super excited to introduce our dig heroes, which are intended to represent everyone in our community. There's the gardener, the homeowner, and of course our favorite, Digger the Dog. <laughs> um, but there are superheroes that are intended for the community and everyone to feel like they can relate to, and for people to really feel like they can be champions of safety in their community. It doesn't have to be that you are the excavator or the contractor in order to know a little something about this digging in the This is just a yard. small group of <laughs> what you could be as a dig hero. The possibilities are endless, but uh, as part of our campaign this year, if you go to beadigherotexas.com, we have a pledge that you can take online. It's very short. And if you take it, you're entered to win a $100 gift card. Hey, we love to hear it. A little cash in addition to the education that we're getting. <laughs> and let's wrap up with who needs to call 811. You know, what is the situation that you're in? Because you don't want to be basically the one out of every two Americans who's not taking the proper precautions. Yeah. When do we need to pick up the phone to call if we are going to be working around in the yard? That's a great question. Some examples are if you're installing a new fence in your backyard, if you're digging um, something deep like to plant a tree or a big shrub, if you're installing a new mailbox, those are just a couple of examples. And if you're unsure, you can go to texas811.org or call 811 just to be safe and make sure you're checking that box. One more thing that it's important to know is to call 48 hours, excluding weekends and holidays, before your digging project, just to give those folks enough time to come out there since it is a completely free service. We're more of a hero when we call earlier. <laughs> but it's good to know, Safina, because I was thinking about replacing my fence this year, and there I didn't go. know that I should be making the phone call. So you've at least converted me this morning, and <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna enter the win <laughs> my $100 as well. Safina, thank you so much for the education this of morning. Course. We appreciate thank it. thank you for having us. Be a dig hero and learn how you can have a chance to win $100, go to BeADigHeroTexas.com. This segment is sponsored by Texas Gas Service.